I told you to stay off my land. You trained that thing? Next time I'll let him tear you to ribbons, Altera. I'm not with Altera. I'm Robin Ayu. I'm looking for information about my sister Sam. I think you might have crossed paths. Bull crap. I suggest you take the time you need to come to your senses and then get off my sea base. If you're not, Altera, why don't you disable that damn tracking satellite tower instead of barging into my sea base? Once Altera's off my back, I'll remember something about your sister. There's some junk on that table that might help. I couldn't get it to work. That far out to sea. Swimming back for land wasn't an option. I'd die from exhaustion long before I made it to shore. All I could do was survive long enough to wash up somewhere. I felt a suction. And suddenly, there were vast jaws rising out of the water towards me. It had taken hours for the Reaper's corpse to float to the surface. Using the knife, I clambered up her flank and got a perch on top. I figured she'd float for a few days at least. Enough for me to kiss her death. But would she sink before or after I died of thirst? I had a knife, a repair tool, and three liters of water. At least I wasn't going to die of exhaustion. Now, those reapers, they're practically all muscle. But there's some fat in there. I was able to keep warm and drink the water. And I didn't have much. But I had that repair tool, so I had a spark. It took a week to light that first fire. And I know more about the burning properties of Reaper fat than I ever cared to. I had to ration fires, but as they burned, I could smoke meat that I carved out of the beast's rib cage. acquired. Rising temperatures detected in mineral-rich fissure below. There I was, 500 meters below sea level. Chunks of the sea base sank around me. One hand gripped the monster scales. The other was clamped around the shard of metal I'd lodged into her eye socket. A reaper. Wounded, maybe, but still deadly. I'd already taken out one eye. I damn near carved out the other. We were headed for the void at the crater's edge. Blinded, she was spiraling deeper. I had a choice. Hold on, or let go. I clung for dear life as she took us deeper. I had one minute of air in the tank. 
Back then, I could go another three with what I had in my lungs. So I had four minutes to kill the Reaper, minus a few to get back to the surface. It ain't that I like killing folk. It's just sometimes what you need is on the inside of someone else's rib cage. I killed that beautiful, terrifying creature, and I made for the surface. When I caught my breath, I realized we'd come further than I thought. I was surrounded by watery void. Just me and ocean. Nothing else. Garden harvests geothermal energy to nurture the life that grows within. Seek fluid intake. Vital signs stabilizing.
can only do repairs in spurts. That's so inefficient. The larger tools seem to set off seismic activity nearby. A crew came back telling stories of gigantic worms burrowing in the ice. I don't know what they're all going on about. They were hypothermic and frostbitten because they walked back to avoid angering them. The ice shelf is probably a bit unstable and they got disoriented or something. To borrow from Diana. Orion's belt. Thermal couplings are not meant to be worked on in 20 minute spurts. If we break the process, we'll break the ship. <sighs> but it's nice to hang out with Yasmin while we wait for the rumbles to stop. I hope she doesn't mind all my questions. I love hearing her voice. Her face lights up, and she's got the most expressive eyebrows. They're practically acrobats. The way she looks when talking about nuclear engineering is the same way I look at my grandmother's domades. And never sits down, though. She told me that she used to do decathlon in college, and I can believe it. She's like a bouncy ball, just all over the place. She makes rounds on the ship every day to see if people need help. Hmm. I should do something nice for her. She's always helping everyone else. I wish I had a fraction of her energy. <laughs> I finished the reactor checks. We dumped a ton of runoff, and we don't need the rods coming down. Then I helped with the scavenging, chopped some veggies with the cooks, and tried to help Diana, but she sent me down to engineering with Stephanos. I've been working with him the last few days. Stephanos, how to describe Stephanos? He's by far the most thorough engineer I've worked with, and no ego. Never leaves a job undone, no matter how late it is. I've never seen him awake before 11, and he always greets me by saying, Calimera, Yasmin, in the sleepiest role. Not a morning person, that one. <laughs> he listens with the slightest smile on his face and twirls this stray curl by his ear. He asks a billion questions, but I don't mind. He surprised me today. There's an empty room on the bridge, just a spot of negative space in the ship. He set the picnic there and said, I need to relax. He even called me a busybody. There were these crazy glowing fungus things he found to send down the ants. The most exciting part though, throw They can jailbreak fabricators. He made a small batch of traditional Grecian dishes. But the craziest part? He managed to make a suitable falafel for me. I never thought I'd see a good falafel in deep space. Alhamdulillah. A quiet genius, that one. This planet may be a cold mistress, but... Maybe it isn't so bad.
In the control room, you can change base lighting and colors, rename your base, and see information about power and structural integrity. But not the integrity of societal power structures. allow you to survey the surrounding region for fragments and material resources like lithium or copper or titanium if you need help finding it for whatever reason Welcome aboard, Captain. The jukebox lets you listen to music, in your base. No one said survival, couldn't be funky.
without spy penglings. Scientists may have never discovered that penglings incubate their eggs in small cave burrows, often alongside thermal lily roots. New creature discovered.
There is a large anomalous mass of rock that has broken away and risen above the surrounding terrain. A 
up. Uh, Danny's not here, I'm afraid. That's okay. It's you I wanted to see. What's that you're working on? Just a sketch for a piece I want to make. <sighs> I'm slacking off. Don't tell the boss lady. <laughs> I won't. It's beautiful. What is it? I'm doing a series inspired by bacteria. Mutant beauty. Life, death, risk. You know, that kind of thing. What's this one? It looks like Karab, but... Vin, is this a mutation? It's just an art project. You know you're doing that thing with your neck, like when you're trying to bluff an alien intruder. <sighs> right, fine. Fine. I'm bad at lying. Are you mutating Kara bacterium from the frozen Leviathan? Here? In this lab? Please, don't ask me any more questions. I don't think I need to. Good morning, Rosmag. Just a quick update to inform you of some key achievements and priority shifts we need you all to get behind. The Spy Penguin Project was a resounding success. Please join me in congratulating Samantha IU, who is now reassigned to Outpost Zero, helping us dream of future initiatives. Congratulations are also in order for Danielle Valenti and her team at Omega Lab. The closing of Phi Robotics means important funds can be redirected to their Kara bacteria study, which has important, positive implications for the life sciences. You're all doing an exceptional job, and I don't want to promise anything. HQ has been taking notice. Keep up the good work. I think we can start discussing bonuses soon. For the last time, I'm not cheating. Then what's your theory? What's going on? If you ask me, Zeta's been blinking a lot. I think it's a tell. He does have a point there. It's allergies. Ah, David, you'll be happy to know the Frost Pack is making excellent progress. <laughs> I must say, my management style appears to be unique well-suited to isolated planets. I miss you, of course. Tower maintenance log. Okay, this time the birds have really done it. I don't know what they've been eating, but it's corrosive when it comes out the other end. I'm short an element to fabricate the right cable. I remember seeing someone who did that dive to the old ship. I'm gonna go out there and see if I can get some more. That should fix it. Maintenance status. In progress. I challenged your spy penguin to a foot race earlier. Because you got tired of losing to me? Ouch. <laughs> what if I've been letting you win so I could see you smile? Cute. But I don't believe it. There are easier ways to make someone smile. Easier than losing a foot race? Oh, I think you're a woman with many talents. What are you implying? The artwork that appeared in my lab the other day? Oh, that. A study in Parhelion Red. I assume you had something to do with that. That depends. Do you like it? It's beautiful. Like the person who gave it to me. If I didn't know better, I'd say you were flirting with me. Do you know better? I... I don't know what I know anymore. Not when you're looking at... You came within range of data that might help with the construction of a new storage medium. You must continue to investigate. I challenged your spy pengling to a foot race earlier. Because you got tired of losing to me? Ouch. <laughs> I strongly sense my people's technology nearby. A body component is near. I challenged your spy pengling to a foot race earlier. Because you got tired of losing to me? Ouch. <laughs> what if I've been letting you win so I could see you smile? Cute. But I don't believe it. There are easier ways to make someone smile. Easier than losing a foot race? Oh, I think you're a woman with many talents. What are you implying? The artwork that appeared in my lab the other day? Oh, that. A study in Parhelion Red. I assume you had something to do with that. That depends. Do you like it? It's beautiful. Like the person who gave it to me. If I didn't know better, I'd say you were flirting with me. Do you know better? I don't know what I know anymore. Not when you're looking at me like that.
this skeleton was very tense, able to handle heavy forces. A good frame for my new form. Are you okay, Alan? It is not often that I gaze upon the form of a fallen architect. Is this place another sort of sanctuary? It's peaceful. Beautiful, even. As the bacterium spread, the continuation of life became uncertain. This is a place to reflect. I think I understand.
Proceed with caution. A Leviathan-class creature is near.
Those of us around the are confusing my senses. And yet I feel certain there is something important below. A facility or a body component. Perhaps both. I cannot tell. There is definitely something of value nearby. It could help you build my body. Construct bionic organs with the scanned material, both primary and secondary. Our designs provide for redundancies. Given your current location, I think they could still be improved. Your feedback has been noted. <laughs> 